So we are intubating this patient who had a road traffic accident. He literally has got his face messed up. So he's got multiple fractures. So you can have a look. He's got multiple fractures on the nasal bones, uh, eye, upper jaw, teeth. Why are you Check that teeth, how it's come down. Why is it moving? His occlusion is deranged, a lot of soft tissue, lacerations. Yeah. So since he's not on the ventilator, you don't see any figures there. Doctor Penda could be drinking here. Fentanyl and propofol. So they've given him fentanyl and propofol. And you can see. So we're fortunate to have some nice green background as you can see. <laughs> While the patient is getting under the anesthesia now. So you'll notice that we turned off the lights 
when the anesthesiologist is having a look inside the patient's throat before the tube is put in uh, so that we can see it clearly there's a small light at the end of that instrument see that the yeah i see that there's a tiny light that comes on so we don't want the big bright lights outside to uh, reduce the intensity for him inside to make it clear and once the tube is in and then we get the other lights on She's auscultating just to check if the tube is in the right position. I'll show you. Those are the oxygen, nitrous, and this is the sevoflurane now. And the palla barunga. Okay. 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 So these sutures were placed elsewhere before he got referred to our place. So some of the abrasions, nothing can be done now. I going to work on these lacerations as well and we're going to suture them up finely so the scar is going to be as minimal as possible. This is a through and through defect from the upper lip. So a lot of expertise is needed for intubating a patient like this who also has jaw fractures, nasal bone fractures and upper jaw and eye orbit fracture because you wouldn't want to move the fractures anymore at the process at the time of uh, doing the giving the anesthesia or putting the tube in. So you see he's doing it very carefully.
Should we have to start with Lama? Thank you so much.